Yo, what up, it's Dom. Sammy Lee here. We are the Soul Brothers. Hello. Uh, the Leak Boys are in the building uh, yes. right now because we have some more images of a leak of the Game 5. Yes, official images actually. Are they official? Yes, official mm -hmm. images. So shout out to who? Shout out to Lace of HK mm -hmm. and the Street Boy. And also shout out to eHawker23 as always. He's a super nice, super dope guy. But anyways, so here is the Dame 5. Looks like shit, there you go. <laughs> hey, oh yo. man, these are pretty damn ugly. Like, so like, of course there's the shit picture leak, you know? Which, you know, when we see it, we get we talk shit about it because it looks like shit, right? That's what we do. But when the uh, official pictures come out, we're like, oh dude, that actually looks dope. And then you see some on foot pics, you know? Like, kind of happened with the Kyrie 5. I liked it from the uh, shit picture leak, but uh, some people did really didn't. And then we saw Kyrie rock out the taco PE, which is super dope. And then uh, everyone really likes him now, but uh, it's not really doing that for me here with the Adidas Dame 5, dude. Yeah, so this there's this yellow red. First of all, these colorways are just garbage. Yeah, so there's this yellow colorway, and then there's this. Which is not. Yellow and black is dope, but then they got this orange and then like. Like blue and orange on the outsole and the midsole. I mean, and then you have a. a I kind of like the paint splatter though in the midsole. That kind of looks cool. Yeah, but just these colors are just. Yeah. Oof. You don't like this? You don't like the teal mint? Teal is cool, but with that yeah. green, I don't know. And then you got a black and red, kind of. Uh huh. Okay. Then, is that a carbon fiber on the midsole? No. no, no. I don't think oh, so. it's just like a. No way. Just a texture. Yeah. It was There's no way it's carbon fiber. I know. Yeah. So, um, yeah, really, these are a little dusty. Yeah, these are. Oh, what is that in the mid, in, uh, medial side? See There's that? another shank plate, if it looks like. Yeah. In the medial side, that comes up, cage you in right there. But why do you need that in the yeah, medial side? It's, <laughs> you're not going to be doing movements this way on. Oh, my, anyways, that doesn't make sense. Um, but release details uh, Street Boy said it's supposed to come out in February 2019 for 115 bucks. Same right. price as a Dame Four, so shout out to Dame, dude. He lo he loves the fans. He he doesn't even have boosts in his, you know. It, it's if I was a signature player, I I want the best stuff that the company has to offer in my shoes. Although but bounce is nice. Bounce is still like super nice, but yeah. you know, I I I think I you know have the boost, you know. Yeah, boost has a little bit more uh, zing to the name. Exactly, for sure. exactly. But he loves the fans and he wants to keep it cheap. So shout out to Dan Damian Lillard. He's a super yeah. cool guy. Uh, seems like but all right, so let's get it started with the tech. Let's uh, start off with the Tracciones So one thing that's interesting to me is okay. not in this colorway, but uh, this color with a black and red one So you see on the kind of like I guess where your big toe is. Mm -hmm. I wonder if it's dual density um, uh, I, I wonder Different if rubber compounds. Yeah, so like I, I think the crazy light boost 2016 had that or whatever so uh, I wonder, maybe, maybe it is, maybe it isn't, it, it, it doesn't really matter, not really. It is a nice herringbone pattern though. Yeah, hopefully it's good and it's definitely a lot better than the 3 and 4. Yes. Which were not great. The 2 was awesome though, yeah. the 2 was awesome. Uh, so yeah, can't really go wrong with herringbone, but if the compound isn't good, then it's probably going to be iffy. But hopefully the compound is really good. So there is that. The cushion midsole is supposed to be uh, bounce, mm -hmm. you know, as always. Dame has always used bounce since the two, I think. Yeah. The one did had um, like some crap. Addy crap. Preen or yeah. something. <laughs> oh, yeah, I think it was Addy Preen. Um, but yeah, the, the, the midsole looks pretty thick and plush. Yeah. The it has a right? little bit of like the wave grooves to it. Yeah. Uh, the, the engineered vibe that they kind of do, or no, the forged technology they kind of do with bounce yeah a little bit just a touch of it though yeah a little bit but the bounce is obviously going to be pretty nice it looks pretty thick it looks a lot thicker than the fours i would say right mm -hmm. like, no Maybe yeah well the, the fours actually come up a lot yeah the fours is actually there's not fours actually really good in that yeah like this whole curvature here is is just caging yes you're actually sitting right about here it's yeah. pretty thin Really, a lot of core feel in the shoe. It all depends on where the, the, the midsole comes up in the Dame 5, but it does look pretty thick. 
So, um, I, I don't know, like, it, it's probably gonna be nice. You know, bounce is usually nice. Hopefully, it feels like the D Rose 9, though. The D Rose 9 felt super nice. Uh, very bouncy, very good impact protection, but bounce, um, as you guys already know, not really worried about cushion there. Uh, moving on to the materials though, the materials are very interesting. It looks like a really shitty mesh, dude. Look at that. Yo. Right? It looks like shit mesh. Yeah. Am, am I tripping? What is going on here? Okay, so let's let's take Easy. a look at this. Look at this material. That's a nice material. It's nice. That's a nice it, it, Even in the two, man, with yeah. the jacquard, jacket yeah. material, the three with this, uh, I forgot what this is called, but it's like a mesh. It's like a TPO, TPU coated mesh almost or yeah, something. Yeah, textile mesh thing. And the four has also like a textile material. Very, very nice. I don't know what they were thinking with the with the fives though, man. They went oh. full shit Nike shit mesh yes. in the forefoot. They collab with uh, Nike on this. But the back half also looks like some felt suede. Am I tripping? Yeah, some like really shitty suede type of material. Oh, like that. Oh my god, bro. What is going on over at Adidas here? <sighs> Um, so that's what uh, well, hopefully it feels nice on in on foot and in hand well, yeah. uh, Hopefully it doesn't feel like shit mesh, but I don't know why you would go from that You know from the Dane 4 yeah. to this with the shit mesh. Ah oh, man Well, if it feels good on foot and it's not too heavy and it's supportive I'm not mad. Yeah, it's, uh, well, we won't be too upset. Hopefully it performs well. It looks like shit though. Watch this wind up in all our top performer videos. <laughs> yeah but um, I, it looks like shit though. Yeah, it, it looks does. like it pretty does. crappy, the materials. Uh, and also you have this little cuff, you know, this ankle collar uh, knit That's material. It's a sweater sleeve. Yeah, but I, I, I don't, it doesn't look like it stretches or anything because you have a tongue. It's not a one booty, right? Yeah. It's not a, yeah, it has a full tongue. So it's not, I don't know what the point of that is. I also don't like how close together the lace, the eyelets are. Oh yeah. It looks like it's already choked out. And for someone with a narrow foot, that scares me. Yeah, because you can't... Because I'm going to have to really choke that yeah, thing out exactly. if it doesn't fit me right. Yeah, so uh, I don't know what they were thinking with that knit. I guess it doesn't really look cool. Um, and it doesn't really serve like look like it serves a purpose. As in, like, it doesn't really, you know, hug your ankle and stretch over your ankle or anything. Because there is a tongue. So is there, yeah, there is 100% a tongue, right? I'm not tripping. Yeah, see? With this yeah. green colorway. Yep. Um, so there, there's that, um, and also on the medial side, like, is that, is that a TPU? Oh no, is that, is that like a hole and then the, that's the material coming through? Oh, maybe. That, interesting. I don't know, on the medial side, it's, it's weird, but, uh, and also on the lateral side, you have this little cage thing. Uh, it reminds me, it reminds us of the Adidas 4D basketball shoe. I think that's the first shoe that we saw with. Oh this. yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it looks almost identical. Yeah. That big plate, which is actually probably good for performance. Yep. Just keeping you in the footbed. Yes. But does it need to be that gnarly? Probably uh, not. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, that's really good for performance. I wonder if if you have this in the midfoot, you don't need really anything in the heel and in the, the forefoot. Maybe. Maybe or maybe not. I don't know. We'll have to try it out um, because usually, uh, if the heel is really good. And then there's, but there's nothing in the forefoot, you, it's still gonna be bad because your forefoot, your pinky toe is gonna still slide under the footbed. But if it's in the midfoot, maybe it'll be a little bit better. Mm -hmm. I don't know, we'll have to try it out and see. But it does look like the midsole does come up as well in the forefoot. So um, I feel like lateral containment is gonna be good. But uh, let's look at the heel. You have a, just a regular ass pull tab. Yeah. Look at how wide that shit is though, look at that. Yeah. See, see that freaking outrigger kind of? That's crazy. That's crazy, but um, anyways, highly five, anticipated February. That's in like three months. Ah oh, man, dude, I don't know. The concept drawing looks super dope, but the actual official images <clears throat> it looks it looks it looks pretty bad. Yeah, oh, man, it looks so cheap. Oh, Hopefully, man. it's a good cheap performer. Ah, I don't yeah, like it. But... Don't like it. Uh, but yeah, hundred fifteen bucks, same price. Shout out to Dame. But uh, just work, maybe rework the Dame 6 and make it look a little bit better, right? Yeah. Tell us what you guys think of the tech. Uh, do you guys think Dame should make his shoes a little bit more expensive and uh, put better materials, premium. you know, and stuff like that? Um, and also, what do you guys think of uh, how it looks, the Dame 5, the aesthetics? And also, do you guys think it'll perform well? But that's it. That's the leak. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Later. Peace.